Hello ladies and gents, Ro here, and welcome to Nono Films. About a week ago, Apple released a new update to Final Cut Pro, and uh, in this tutorial, or this video, I'm going to show you guys how to update Final Cut Pro and the basic new features to Final Cut Pro. Now, let's go ahead and open up your App Store. To update, you're just gonna go straight to your App Store, and uh, within here, you can also find it on the apple.com if you don't have the App Store, but I'm gonna open up the App Store, and uh, Within top charts, you'll be able to find Final Cut Pro, and from here you'll have the update option as well. But uh, the new update is 10.2.1, and here are what it includes. Just these three new features, but they're critical. Restores support for the Panasonic, it's basically a specific camera here, video at 25 pixels and 30 pixels. Now we also got improves accuracy when dragging to select a range and the timeline. And that's basically with the range selection tool, I believe. And then also we got the fixes an issue that may cause Final Cut Pro to quit on launch, which I've personally had before. Now that's the basics. I'll have those in the description for you guys as well. Now to update, you can also go to the updates tab here and then you'll be able to find the Final Cut Pro update and run that update as well, just by simply hitting update. But that's the basics of the new Final Cut Pro update. Um, be sure to leave any comments or questions. If you're having issues updating, go ahead and let me know. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys next tutorial and later. So let my life be the proof, the proof of